Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Mary and this is Sunlight Insight Tarot. Thank you so much for stopping by and watching. If you're new or returning, welcome, welcome, and thank you. So we're going to do a little overview here first before we get into each individual sign on this full moon in Virgo for March, which does happen on March 18th, which is a Friday. There's many different names for this moon. One is called the Worm Moon, where the uh, worms start to come out for the spring season and then you know the uh, wildlife begins to feast as in the birds and such like that uh, but it's also two days before the spring equinox and that spring energy of course is always an energy of rebirth and new beginnings and of course full moon energy is also completion full circle it can be endings and changes transformation abundance the moon is also about um intuition higher knowing going into depth with energies emotions feelings it's about changes and cycles um, energy as well and now the full moon in virgo can be about you think of the hermit energy um, it can be about solitude reflection healing understanding and learning um, and also that virgo energy is in earth can be about routine order work and service and also manifestation and progression as an earth energy Earth is grounding, stability, wealth, abundance, wise, practical, smart, uh, analytical, safe and slow, no rushing as well. And we're still in the uh, sun in Pisces, uh, which I think is until the uh, 19th and then the 20th we transition into Aries. So the sun in Pisces right now is as a mystical, dreamy, intuitive, spiritual, empathetic, artistic, sensitive, uh, romantic kind of energy. And water is healing, flowing, emotions, cleansing, intuition, and depth, much like the moon, a little bit different moon, uh, Pisces, water sign as well. So that's the energy that we're working with. So we're going to look into all energies for each individual reading. I have uh, love decks, general decks, uh, angel decks here, power of surrender. We'll get into the tarot. So stay tuned here and let's jump right into your readings. Hi Libra, welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're all doing well, staying safe and healthy at this time. So let's see what's going on for you during this full moon in Virgo, March energies. So this is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, any heavy placements, male or female, general collective reading. Please only take what resonates for you, including the signs mentioned. And you definitely can flip, switch, reverse energies around anytime you feel the need to as well. Cross watchers could actually be a reading or some messages in here for you as well. So please do keep that in mind. All right, Libra. Let's see, we have, I love you. Well, now Libra, these are very important words and we have 20, which is two choices, decisions, partnerships, and unities. And we have rest and relaxation is essential. We all have a fundamental need to take breaks and we have 42 which is six which is all about peace harmony and balance so libra you may be uh having a lot going on right now and you may be neglecting yourself and it's telling you here to take some time for you rest rejuvenate relax uh do things you like to do take a bubble bath you know just you know sit in your favorite chair read a book you know just be still calm relaxed and do something for you and uh, somebody may be getting ready here to say, I love you, or vice versa. So let's see. <clears throat> Libra, what is going on for you? Everything you do need to know about me and this channel, Libra, is down below in the description box. Check that out if you like to. Your playlists are down there as well. If you are new here, um, I was doing weekly readings and a weekend love reading, kind of changing the format to back to monthlies. It's not so time constraining for me. Um, I work a full-time job, 40 to 50 hours a week, and trying to get those weeklies out on a timely manner for a specific time period is just too uh, too much right now. So monthlies are a little more lax, and I can kind of get them out when I can. But I'm going to try to do as many as I can and many different topics as well. So you can keep an eye out for that. Let's see what we have. Time to breathe out. Well, doesn't that make sense? And a win-win outcome is forecast. Full moon in Libra. There you go. So this is definitely for you, Libra. So there is a win-win uh, situation here. So just take a time out. You know, you may be going through a lot right now. Um, could be legalities. It could be other things. And it's like, you know, 
it will go in your favor things will go in your favor whatever that may be so just take some time for you at this time you know being worried or upset or anxious or nervous or keeping yourself too busy to kind of take your mind off something isn't really going to help the situation so just it's time to just you know be calm relaxed take care of you take a time out because it is time to take a deep breath and breathe out just breathe out Libra everything's going to be fine whatever that means for you <clears throat> all right and if you didn't know it I did uh, create a backup channel I just created it the other day so you can go and sub to that if you like so if something happens to this channel you'll be sub to that channel link is below and also there's a daily poll every single day and you can vote on previous one as well and right now I'm asking people to vote on what kind of content they would like to see on that channel if I decide to post content on that channel if I have time or if I ever do this full time I may have two channels so you can go and vote on those polls as well all right Libra let's see what we have creativity that's been coming out quite a lot all right so you know maybe if you dabble in the arts or you do crafts or something fun um, it's telling you to you know take some time to get back into your hobbies your creative projects um, things that relax you as well we have oh Archangel Michael you are protected so this can talk of uh, truth clarity protection um, it could be legalities legal matters um, that you are protected so don't worry things will go in your favor so let me just read you a little about little bit about Archangel Michael protection truth justice and power so the powers that be are at hand here and just know that you are protected truth clarity will come in and uh, I don't think you have to worry here as well so spirit has your back spirit has your back Libra but let's see what this you know maybe it's just time to love yourself you know I love you it's time to love give some love to yourself if you've been giving a lot of love to others as well it could be it's just time to love yourself all right let's see Libra what is going on for you and if you're wondering if someone does have feelings for you I would say a holy hell yes with I love you there <clears throat> it could be that someone's going through a divorce or legal matters right now okay let's see Libra what does Libra need to know strength wow <laughs> Leo energy so being strong courageous and brave a willpower determination this could be about holding back as well uh, past life energy strong connection that cannot be denied overcoming so things will overcome here whatever your situation may be we have the five of swords and the hermit so Virgo energy here so we are in the full moon in Virgo we have the five of swords so this could be you know if there's been conflict sabotage lies deceit um, negative energies at play where someone tried to um, win at their own benefit I feel like truth will be shed on a situation here very deceiving situation whatever that may be somebody maybe did something sneaky um, change is coming and the hermit here I feel like is shedding light on the situation so the hermit is about introspection enlightenment uh, being still uh, quiet learning growing expanding finding the light I feel like someone will find like a piece of information that will come to light here so you may not be seeing a lot going on in a situation right now but something will come to the forefront this could be a wise uh, person here as well finds a light in a situation that sheds light on whatever happened here so this will overcome this will be overcome oh, judgment yeah final judgment here wow Scorpio this I feel like whatever this last bit of information that comes in now this sounds very specific will give the final judgment like a very quick uh, judgment on a situation here now we have Scorpio I mean this can be about you know healing forgiving things of the past past life energy uh, can be resurrection 
there may be something that of the past that was kind of uh, dormant for a while and all of a sudden a new piece of information comes out that kind of brings this back into the forefront and change changes the outcome whatever that may be hmm. and you know this is also about healing forgiving or releasing letting go for the new um as well life review relationship review i feel like something's going to happen here that brings this back into review it puts like the last piece together in this page of cups pisces energy it's a very sincere um piece of information maybe coming from a child that makes sense two of swords see this is about decision protection decision archangel michael see i feel like this is something that is not something not that people will not see coming or an unknown situation or piece of information comes to light that was very unknown no one will see this coming and it become could be coming from an unlikely source maybe a child or somebody um youthful it's a sincere piece of information i feel it's like out of the blue uh, maybe there's a child that kind of this sounds like a private reading but maybe a child all of a sudden has a flashback or a memory and it's a piece of information that puts the last puzzle piece together here so i'm kind of seeing like the star as a puzzle piece whatever this means here but somebody you know could also be making a judgment call to resurrect a connection with you making that decision maybe can't stop thinking about you maybe they sabotaged it in the past you know maybe there was denial maybe there was um you know something where they just did not want to admit their feelings that they did love you strong feelings that cannot be denied and maybe there was a lot of holding back but i feel like someone's making a sincere gesture to resurrect this and making that decision here i feel like you're not going to see this coming someone that really could not stop thinking about you even during quiet times separation um solitude all right what else do we need to know here for libra knight of swords happening very quickly now this could be you libra or this is aquarius for me but this is something happening very very quickly All right, let's get a little more eight of pentacles i feel like if this was like uh, a situation or a case or two of pentacles something was left up in the air so we have the eight and the two which is the ten of pentacles so that is you know uh wealth abundance prosperity so the win-win outcome could be you know getting the settlement or winning a case or something like that I feel like even though it's been like still up in the air after all this time, you know, I don't think anyone ever stopped working on it. You know, it just didn't seem like anything was happening. Could be somebody you met at work. Happened very quickly, but there's a lot of imbalance surrounding the connection as well. A lot of uncertainty to uh, twos here for a sword. So again, a lot of, again, taking a time out to heal this is about thinking, healing, contemplating, not taking action right now, just resting, rejuvenating. Ace of Swords. So my divine clarity from Swords. So this is something for someone here. Awakening, epiphany, aha moment, uh, divine clarity, communication, successful new beginning, cutting away things no longer serving, standing up, telling it like it is now. Spirit's pointing me out here. The two and the ace would give you the three of swords. So this has been a lot of heartache surrounding uh, some sort of situation here or disappointment. An illusion seven of cups but see page of swords someone is coming forward with some sort of information so either they've been watching this or um been afraid to come forward but somehow they will get the courage to come forward so various energy as well some sort of information coming in which leads to the happiest outcome the sun leo energy massive healing success victory enlightenment growth expansion happy human family Soulmate to inflame, peace, harmony, joy, love. Best outcome you can have there, Leo. Yeah, it's going to happen quickly. Cancer energy, positive movement forward, drive, ambition, balance, success, victory. Traveling or moving? May require some traveling or moving here. 
justice. Oh my God, on the top of the deck. Libra energy, that's you. So truth, clarity, justice, balance, universal law and order, getting what we deserve. Again, this could be divorce for someone. Then here comes a solid offer, Capricorn energy. And this could be the settlement coming in as well. So whatever this means for you, Libra, I'm getting so many energies here. You need a time out. You need to stop worrying. Take care of yourself. Get back to the things you love. This will go in your favor, whatever this means for you. You are protected not only by Archangel Michael, but maybe law or government or whatever that is for you. Um, some sort of piece of information will come out that puts the final decision on this that goes in your favor. So it could be getting the settlement, money or whatever, long-term wealth, growth, abundance. Somebody could be rushing in here now they made up the decision that they want to come forward and work on this long term. It could be happening very, very quickly. And also I feel like it could be someone you met at work very quickly. Feelings developed, but it was very shaky up in the air. Um, nothing ever came of it or a lot of indecision. Somebody could have really expressed how they felt about someone. Uh, someone was indecisive of what they wanted to do with that information as well. But I feel like someone is overcoming and they will come forward. And I feel like they're changing on the mind here regarding feelings for someone and they may be rushing in say holy hell i love you now libra you know i didn't want to admit it before but now i do all right let's see what else do we need to know here for libra six of swords moving into calmer waters could be traveling or distance but moving into peace harmony balance so you'll be able to leave the situation behind you and you will lead into peace harmony balance success victory Leaving it finally, finally behind. Yeah. And as I say that, the Six of Wands is success and victory. Here comes the offer coming in. Quickly. Success and victory. Two cards of healing, balance, just like the Justice, Libra. Any here? Energy here. What else here for Libra? There's the King of Cups. Somebody who knows how they always felt. They hit it. Pisces energy. We're in Pisces season right now. And, you know, getting in tune in touch with their emotions, their feelings, uh, intuition, their compassion, love, peace, harmony, joy. Now wants to come forward with their full cup. They hit it before. They hit it before. Full <laughs> leap of faith. Aquarius energy. Now they want to take this leap of faith. So this is new energy coming in. So there's an energetic reset here. Be able to leave this situation behind, whatever that was for you. Because the wind, wind forecast is here. And somebody now coming in wanting to erase whatever happened in the past. Let's have a reset. Let's start over. Let's take this leap of faith. Here's my cup. Will you accept it now? All right. Let's see. Trusting everything will be fine. It's Aquarius. Magician manifesting a new beginning. You always get the magician after the fool. Infinity here. So many lifetimes together. Manifesting a new beginning, Gemini Virgo. Wow. New beginnings at hand here. Brand new beginning. Oh my God, I can't make it up. Brand new beginning in love. Here's my cup, Libra. Will you accept my overflowing cup of love? Oh my goodness. I'm ready to manifest this with you, Libra. Let's do it. Let's do it, Libra. Will you accept it? Let's get one more. You're going to think about it here. <laughs> You're going to think about it. Oops, what is that? The Queen of Swords. Well, that's you, Libra. Oh my goodness, I can't make it up. You want answers. You want information. You want truth, clarity. You want to know any energies have been cut out that needed to be cut out. Upfront, honest. Wow. Okay, Libra. Well, there you go. And on the bottom, Seven of one, uh, Swords. Seven of Cups. Like, why did you run and leave me confused? I want to know. And now you're coming forward. Chariot Energy. After a long time of holding back. So that's Cancer. Being defensive. I want to take this slow. Knight of Pentacles Energy. Taurus. I want to take it slow. I want to see where it goes. I want to make sure you're not going to run. And leave me confused. And hold back. I want to know you're sincere. Oh my God, the sun after that. So happiness, joy. Two soulmates coming together. Page of Rods. A star. Healing. Divinely guided energy, peace, harmony, joy, balance, page of rods, communication, excitement, passion, 
I want to know it's more than passion. But we got the sun there. So definitely here in the lovers. Oh my God, Gemini energy. Soulmate energy. Page of Pentacles. Again, since they offer, but let's take it slow. Capricorn energy. Seven of Pentacles. Let's, let's invest slowly. Take our time and not rush. Because I am worthy and I know what I want. The Empress here, Libra Taurus. Libra, you. I know what I want. So I'm not going to rush this. Wow. Libra. Libra. All right. Let's get you some advice and guidance. Advice and guidance for Libra. Also, Libra, you, you're going to get the true clarity you need. You'll be able to walk away from any kind of legal situation, if that resonates for anyone. Uh, leaving it in the past. You're getting the answers you need. Success. Oh, you're holding that Ace of Swords, which we did see. So you will get the truth, the clarity. All right. Libra. What do we need to know here for Libra? Surrender stubbornness. If you are tensing up or taking a rigid stance about something, gently observe yourself and become more yielding. This will help you communicate more lovingly with others and yourself. Okay, so maybe, the, you know, somebody here, maybe they were stubborn, you were stubborn at saying, you know, we need to kind of release that. Surrender to the magic of who you are. We all have magic in us, even in the mundane aspects of life. Remember that you are a magical being with a uniqueness and worth that come from just being you. All right, what else for Libra? This person now sees the magic of who you are, Libra. And they're giving up, they're surrendering their stubbornness about uh, just coming into terms that they love you, Libra. They love you. There's no doubt about it. Surrender negative thinking. You have control over your thoughts. When negative thoughts surface, say thank you for sharing and quickly refocus on positive affirmation. So don't think negatively about your situation if it's not the love situation, but the other situation. Try to be more positive because you have a win-win outcome here. You have, and you are heavily protected. Archangel Michael showing up. Definitely heavily, heavily protected here. All right. And, you know, you may think negatively of this person, but I think they're coming in very with a very sincere offer of a full cup. Surrender to your soul's path. Your life's journey has been perfectly designed for your soul's growth. Embrace every lesson and every moment. Yep. Somehow you're meant to walk this path as difficult as it may be or have been. But it's all to grow you um, spiritually, mentally, physically, emotionally as well. Surrender your fear of change. The universe is reminding you that you are cared for always, whether you're afraid of a change in your job, your health, or a relationship. Or if you fear aging or death, repeat this affirmation. I have faith that all is well. Exactly. So you may be fearing that the situation is not changing because whatever... Um, if it's a legal situation, you may be like, oh my God, this has been like so drawn out and long and I don't see the end is near. I don't see the change there. But like I said, some sort of piece of information comes forward that changes the whole dynamic and it's going to end quickly. That's what I feel here. So just trust and know Archangel Michael here is going to make this happen. You are protected. Someone is coming in with truth and clarity to say, you know, um, I ran, I was scared, I was fearful. But I love you. I can't get a can't get away from that now. And I want to come forward and offer my full cup of love. And will you accept this overflowing cup, Libra? That's what I feel. All right, Libra, that's what I have for you. So I hope that helped it resonate again. And don't forget to do the things that you love to do. You know, get your mind off of these things for a while here. Wishing you the best. Again, don't forget to check out your uh, playlist. Your March love is out. Vote on the polls. Uh, you could sub to the new channel. What you like to see, vote on that as well. On that channel if I do decide to post on there. So wishing you the best Libra and I shall see you next time.